the old gatekeeper here. Out here around the beautiful state of GA. Big GA, baby, as they say. And uh, I've been thinking since about a year and two months ago when I decided to get back into the mass to begin the my, my little plan I came up with to the mass distribution of the infamous HG semi products transistors I, I knew I was going to do it a couple of steps and start selling privately first which is what I'm doing now I mean yeah, I'm selling publicly to the public, but I'm making transactions privately, meaning I do not have a public website up yet. And uh, by HG's agreement, publicly you have to sell uh, using a retail price agreement. So what I've been doing is just doing a little discounted private transaction sales just until I get my website up and rolling just to kind of get me started good out there so I was sitting there thinking we're here at the end of July and to me to go, going on my past experiences I'm, I'm, I'm decently happy with myself I'm not going to use the word I'm proud of myself but I'm very decently happy with myself with how I have grown in this side of my business and of course, I, the other part of my businesses, which is amplifier, construction, building, and repair, I have not been able to publicly take on any of that work for a little while now, because uh, I ain't got to say, but just in case you <laughs> haven't, haven't heard, you know, I've, I've got deeply, deeply behind years ago, years ago. And once I finally get uh, called up good, which is coming very quickly now, I am going to make a video and just kind of show everybody how, I'm going to come out and openly show everybody how I messed up dramatically and uh, and, and and hope maybe any newer builders coming out there to start, maybe they won't make the same mistakes. you got to be kidding me. That is my uncle from Maryland. from Maryland. There's no way. There is no way that is uh -uh. from Maryland. Let me see here. Hey, Uncle Tom. I thought that was you. <laughs> hey, I was doing a little video here on YouTube, and I said, that looks like my uncle from Maryland. But then it hit me, y'all are down, because I remember yeah. Mom and Dad coming to see you. Yeah, we got a little leak in the sand filter the pool, a little crack in it. And I know it's got a little bit of pressure, and probably best to replace it, but I'm going to try to see if I can fix it with epoxy. Oh, it's, uh, yeah, it's like a sand made. It's made out of fiberglass. It's kind of like a big shape like that right there. It's, it's a sand filter, you know, for so I don't know how it works. But it's got a little crack in it and it's leaking water. So I'm gonna try to fix it with some epoxy. You can't just shut it off. Huh? You can't just shut it off. Yeah, then we then the fil but yeah, the pool won't be filtered in. So I'm gonna try to see if at least some epoxy will hold it till the end of summer and then replace it next uh you know by next summer well good seeing you man yeah, like, maybe i'll come by what, what time y'all leaving what day probably uh certainly no more than a week it'd be next week monday tuesday wednesday okay I'm not sure. maybe i'll try to swing by and see y'all for a little bit yeah good seeing you bud yep that was my my uncle from maryland as soon as I got out of the car good, and I was sitting there thinking, I was like, you know what, they are down. So you get to be traveling like that when you're retired. 
So yeah, I'm up here at uh, the old Home Depot. I need to pick up some water epoxy. But anyway, let me go ahead and get through this video so I won't sit here and be bored, y'all. Basically, I had an idea. As you know, I don't have any overhead at all. I don't have anybody that works for me or anything. Need some acetone. Um, so I thought I'd do something kind of neat and do an end of July sale on HG transistors. Now, like I said, I can't publicly tell you what the prices are going to be. I'm going to tell you one thing. <laughs> it's going to be very cheap. Very cheap because also I have... Um, I'm stocked up pretty heavy as well, so it'd be a nice little way to get some of this stock out. Because right now I'm sitting with about 240 C's um, and a little bit over 200 or so standards. I've got a mix uh, that just came in of, uh, of you know 454s, 2290s, 1446s, and I still got a, a good bit of 1969 2312 finals too. So it'd be kind of a good way to get that out. So until August 1st, I'm going to send a little text message to everybody that's uh, purchased from me this last year, a little bit over a year. But we're going to be running a end of the July HG transistor sale. If you're needing transistors, now's going to be the time to get them before August the 1st. Another thing, it's time for another giveaway, y'all. It's time for another HG giveaway. We won't do that in this video, though. We'll do that in another one. So, uh, let me do my stuff here in the store. And, uh, yeah, I heard BBI's in town, by the way. He's up at the Wolfman CB shop. If I didn't have so much going on, maybe I'd run up there and see you. I need to go see D-Rail anyway, but I'm sure a lot of people got to go up there and, and meet Mr. Luke Miller. I had a couple of people hit me up and tell me that he's around our neck of the woods. Well, to give you an idea where I'm at, um, D-Rail, a.k.a. Wolfman CB Shop, they're about 40 minutes from me. Uh, just about a 40 minute or so ride and his town is in the town that my father my dad grew up in which is a very small town uh, called Carnesville, Georgia so that's pretty neat that's the actual town that my dad grew up in and I grew up going to that town and I remember growing up hating to to, to, to ride in a car because it's you know it's about 45 minutes to an hour you know if you're driving slow I remember growing up. I remember growing up being young and excited, but by the time I hit my teens, you know, you want to do your own thing when you're in your teens, and you don't hate them. You kind of hate them long car rides. I mean, we had Walkmans and and, and uh, Game Boys and stuff like that, but I got car sick pretty easily, and I still do get car sick pretty easily, and that's kind of what I hated. So usually when I take a big trip to a beach or something I had a long trip I usually do my best to sleep the whole the whole time yeah I get cost it sucks but anyway let me get on off here y'all just want to uh, make that uh, make a quick video let you know we're gonna be doing the end of July sale and yeah, I can't wait to let you know what the cause I'm already selling this game as it is you know we're gonna be moving up to retail prices as soon as my website gets put up and uh, I just need to take me about a day or two I can spend to get that bad boy uh, finished up. But right now I'm doing renovations on my work area because cats have put multiple holes in my dang work area. And I cannot keep the air condition. I can't keep the temperature no lower than about 98 degrees. You cannot work in that, in that environment, man. You're literally pouring sweat all over what you're trying to work. So I've been I've been spending at least two to three hours on that every day because it wasn't just me getting in there and fixing the holes. Nah, over the last the last two three years since I put that up that little plastic uh, curtains, I have piled a lot of heavy stuff around it. I had one guy move to New York and he gave me a lot of a lot of stuff, man. Heavy stuff, all kinds of Motorola radios that do like two three hundred watts. 
for where any police cars and stuff. And, and I mean, just I just piled it all right there. So I'm just slowly getting everything and getting bit by wasps, stung by wasps at the same time. Let me get on off here, y'all. I'll be sending the message out, but uh, shoot me a text, 678-557-4846. 678-557-4846 and asks me, hey gatekeeper, what is the end of July price list for the transistors? And I think it will astonish you. OGK out here around the northeast end of Georgia. God bless y'all 73. Bye-bye.